Gravity flow systems using collector tanks have been mandatory equipment for over 40 years in the state of Florida for suction and trapment avoidance on public pools and bathing places. In that period of time, there has never been a recorded death from suction and trapment where collector tanks have been operating. Gravity flow piping and collector tanks are actually very simple to understand. On a traditional pool, a pump obtains water from the pool by a direct suction connection to the main drain in the lowest part of the pool floor. On a gravity flow system, a pump obtains water from a remote tank called a collector. This tank is buried to a point where, when full, the water level in the tank is statically level with the water in the pool. This is achieved by plumbing a pipeline from the main drain sump in the pool to a coupling connection on the side of the collector tank. It is important to size this main drain pipe connection so that the required GPM of water produced by the pump does not travel at a speed of more than three feet per second through the pipe. For example, if a pump is used that produces 100 gallons per minute of flow, a 4-inch pipe must be used. By using a standard flow chart, we can see that 3-inch pipe exceeds 3 feet per second after it reaches 65 gallons per minute. 4-inch pipe can handle up to 110 gallons per minute at 3 feet per second. Another important point is that the gravity line from the main drain must follow a line of travel that doesn't allow camel humps or airlocks. Since water is moving from the pool to the collector tank based on atmospheric pressure and not from a direct pump suction, airlocks would interrupt the flow. This example will demonstrate an airlock. This device is designed to emulate an airlock in a horizontal pipe. Water has been poured into each side of the lock showing that unless the air is evacuated, water will not flow through the pipe. As the air is released through a small vent on the highest point of the airlock, water will freely flow from point A to point B without blockage. When a swimmer covers a main drain grate on a direct suction swimming pool, excessive force sucks the body to the drain. Until the pump is turned off, it is almost impossible for someone to escape from the entrapment. When a swimmer covers a main drain grate utilizing a collector tank system, water stops flowing to the collector tank, but no suction force is produced on the swimmer. Since there are no moving parts or periodic adjustments to be made to a gravity flow system or collector tank, it is the only fail-safe method to prevent suction entrapment. If you have any questions or concerns about your system that are not covered in this tutorial or your manual, call 800-877-1824 and speak with a service technician.